Yo, 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 yo. Yo, yo. What's up, y'all? What's going on? How y'all feeling? All right, everything's good on my end. How about y'all? Man, I can't complain. I've been relaxing, taking it easy. I think I'm going to get some target practice on some people real soon. Hey, hey. Squeeze keep running his mouth. I'm going to see. I'm going to see. I'm going to see. I'm going to see. Um... You ain't got to look for me because Mr. Will, I'm getting tired of this. <laughs> hey, Mr. Will. Hey, Mr. Will. I'm great. Nigga <laughs> ain't be black history, but somewhere. Oh, <laughs> hey, man. Love over here. A famous old black gangster. Uh. <laughs> Oh, hey, welcome everybody to the Rise Podcast, man. Make sure y'all hit that like button on your way in, man. Y'all been doing us dirty on the likes, man. Make sure y'all hit that like oh. button. Treat us greasy and a comb easy. Mm-hmm. Um, damn, Mr. Will, what? Um, let me get the sponsors out of the way. Five time world champ, four different weight classes. Did his thing. I guess Hector God said he still won't give him his credit. You line him up, we're gonna knock him down. Um, he gonna take it. You already know who he is. First ballot Hall of Famer, GTD Promotions. Don't forget to go on www.kanichibed.com. Use code TRP. You'll get 15% off. Support the young CEO. Redesigning minds one mind at a time. We know the mind is a terrible thing to waste. Um, Rise Inc. Thanks for the platform. Rise in the building. Show us some love, y'all. Uh, Under Armour, thanks for all that you do on the U. I got the, the U on. The U in the building. Last but not least, the official gear boxing. Y'all already know what it is. All the fighters wearing it. Y'all saying with me in the chat. Come on, y'all. Show us some love tonight. Candy, Candy Rain, what's going on? Alan Johnson, how you feeling? Can't stop Uncle E, Princess Miss Arena. 86 Baby Mary, South Park TV, Isaiah McCoy. Antonio King, Tommy Nettles, P. Ollie, welcome to the channel. Jay Cropper, Big She New Ears, Big Ray, what's happening, champ? Deep Wayne, Rocco McBride, Nephew Timothy Stoudemire, Big Bro TV, can't wait for you to come back to the gym, champ. Mike Tyson, Soldier J, Young Doug 2022, Ace, Mr. Positive at All Times, Black Paul, Tasha Reese White, Anthony Red, Stretch the G, All Funny Video, North and Green Mountain and Building. Platinum Alkaline Ward, a squeeze. Yo. I'm going to have to see Platinum Alkaline. That's why I was staying late in the gym. He told, he, I thought he said he was coming through today. Yo, I ain't got no water. Yo. I feel some type of way. I want to be healthy. I need some Platinum Alkaline Water. Damn. Yeah, I'm, I, I got to start calling people out, yo, because they so, playing. So, what's your... Give me your top three you want to see in, in the order you want to see them in. Because you've been calling some people out. Maybe we can get these fights. Give me your top right. three, champ. All right, all right, all right. First. Damn. I think that's the unanimous right there. First is the Smoothie King, without a <laughs> doubt. I got to see him first. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I knew he was. <laughs> That's without a doubt. I need to see this movie game first. <laughs> off the rip. Second, I'm trying to figure out who's second. Is it gonna be platinum out the line or that nigga that gave us the red badge and not the green one? <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh who your third? Who your third? Yeah. Hey, um... I had to be platinum, yo. He playing games with the water, yo. He playing games with the water. I'm gonna have to see your platinum. top three, Mr. Will. Ain't make your top three. No, I'm saying, like, he right there on the borderline. If platinum come through, if platinum come through with the water, 
Then, then <laughs> Mr. Will going to jump right in the number three. Oh, man. Oh, man. Without a doubt. Easy. Mr. Will, we ain't going to need no recount or nothing. Oh, man. Well, Goose oh. L. Neal, what's happening? Kenneth Perry, what's going on? Anthony Ford, how you feeling? Anthony Riggs, nephew, Jarrell Heidi, what's going on? She loving the Maha. What's up, champ? Bancroft, Lewis 4,500. Boxing Dad, what's going on? The princess, where you been? The queen, yeah, yeah, lean. Where you been at? Smoothie King. King. Right back at you with another one. Yeah, yeah, lean. The queen, the boss lady of the Rise podcast. Thanks for the 20-piece McNugget. Hello, Rise family. Miss you guys. It's still GTD all day. It was a it was a pleasure chopping it up with you. Glad, glad you're back. Platinum P, what's going on? Download the day to knock you out later. Okay, okay, I like that. Uh, Eddie got a tank uh, picture on there. I like that. Download the day to knock you out later. Uh, damn. Walter Lee, Jesse Sr., all the way from hey, Kuwait, Kuwait City, Kuwait. Kuwait. Hey, Kuwait. Good morning. I know it's about 3, 4 o'clock in the morning over there. Good morning, champ. Um... Ragi Bali. Ooh, Platinum say 80-20 versus me. No, nah, you, ain't, you ain't the A-side. Damn. Y'all say 80-20. <laughs> Y'all try Bud Crawford. Yeah, ain't crazy, man. Right. Maurice Jones, Four Corners Boxing. Right. What's happening, Jack? Really you want to fight, you will take it. Man, I'm not. No, fuck that. You really want to fight. The people want to see that fight. You you should take it. You shouldn't worry about because you're gonna get a rematch clause. You still gonna make some few dollars. You heard what Buzz said? Pound for pound, number one worth more than that. <laughs> <laughs> now, now, what you got to say, chat? Oh shit. No, nah, you supposed to take the fight. You a real champ, like you say. It shouldn't be about the depths. Nah, man, I'm just saying, 80-20? No, they ain't. I'm going to bring up the too. Lil Tank Gang, what's up, champ? Lil Tank Gang. I'm going to sell some tickets, too. This ain't all platinum. Uh, platinum. I know, he, <laughs> I, know he, I know he got 92Q with him and all that, but no, this is bigger than that. I sell tickets, too. Mocha 3. Hey, when we was walking the stadium, didn't they say senior what's up? Didn't they know me when we was walking around? I mean, I wasn't as big as the Smoothie King, but they knew me a little bit, too. So I gotta get my credit. Mocha 03. Hey, 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 Miss Lady. Mad Titan, what's going on? Hey yo. Hey yo, how you wanna start this off? Please get the likes up, Mocha 03. How you wanna start this off, chat? Um I'm a little, I'm a little, I'm a little, I'm a little uh worried. Uh oh. I'm a little <laughs> worried, chat. The eighty twenty. No, nah, no, nah, no. Nah. Listen, the biggest, the biggest fight, one, of, the big, no, not not one of the biggest fighters of his career. And you, y'all heard the rumors where the fight supposed. To... James Vaughn, what's going on? I'm from Detroit. Love you, guys, man. Truly great brother. Give him a smoothie king. Smoothie king, right back at you. What another one? James Vaughn, I'm from Detroit. Uh, love y'all guys, man. Truly great brothers. Respect what you guys do. And Coach Squeeze, your laugh get me every time. Oh, my God, Ron, Ron Garcia is a pretty girl. Mm. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, Look, hey, like I said, shame. Ooh. Ain't nobody know that. Hey, Platinum, Look. go www.noslihp. That's how you support, support Young Damari with his painting. That's his I website right there with Kenichi Bear. Boy, boy Ryan Garcia. I was just going to say that boy Ryan Garcia, Justin Bieber of boxing. That's what he is. Yeah. I'm just, I'm just saying, like, you got your biggest fighter on the horizon, and you talk about you right back away from social media. I don't, I, huh. That don't make that. I mean, that's, that ain't adding up. Like, you supposed to be trying to sell a fight. That's why people mad. People mad that Roley got that fight, but he sold the fuck out that fight. Yeah, he did. he did. So I'm saying, like, what is what is Ryan like? What is it, his way of thinking? Like these dudes be killing me, man. Like, come on, man. This is the biggest fight in that man your career. Like, what, what you mean you getting on social media? 
crazy. Help me out. Help me out, Squeeze. Help me understand. Well, Kenny said it. Yeah, yeah. Hey, hey, this lady. Lip Ball Swami said it uh, over a year ago when he was on hot boxing with Mike Tyson, calling Tank out, talking about ah, Eddie did. and all this, that, and the other. And Kenny seen he was scheming. So he know he know he going to sleep. He don't. He going to sleep. He already know. Hey. Tight will go to that body. Tight definitely gonna go to that body. He been touched in his body like that, neither. No. No. Hey, Maurice Jones. I need my I need my sweatshirt to say, "Are you sleepy?" Ryan Garcia, are you sleepy? Oh, yeah, I definitely did see that all funny video. Keyshawn Davidson to go. He said to go. Yeah. I mean, that, 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 that's, that, that shouldn't be too much of a. Give me some ice, huh? Give me some ice. She does. Hi. What did he do? Hey, hey. He said, uh, oh. I look like a DJ. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> damn. Mixing and scratching. What's oh, up, yeah. C Dub? What's up? I might come back to the gym. All right, now, I'm going to be waiting for you. We're going to tear it up. We got to claim some names, line them up. All right. We got to take our place back. Oh yeah. So I can get you right. All right. All right. All right. All right, chat. Right, come on. We got a show to do. That's my little broke ass DJ. Oh, <laughs> I, I, I got money in What's that, in chat? Yeah, man. I'm telling you. That's what it is. I like that fight though for uh Keyshawn. To, to, to go in uh Keyshawn? Yeah, I like that for him. Yeah, How that like, fight go? Uh, How that fight go? Um it's a different matchup for to go. I think to go will be a little more aggressive. A little more aggressive in that fight. So um that, that, that would be interesting. But I don't know, man. I think Keyshawn might get him out of there. What you think, Mr. Will? Hey, Mr. Will, you got your ears going. 10-4. 10-4. Keyshawn, you got You breaking up, Mr. Will? Can't hear you. I heard you. You breaking up? I can't hear you. Come on, Mr. Will. Come on, Mr. Will. You sound terrible, yeah. Mr. Will. Yeah. I can't hear. Man. Oh, I don't know why. I bet my gosh. Might be where I am. I don't know. I already, said, I already seen you out. Make me come back in. What's up, South Park uh, TV? What's happening? Whoa. Oh, yeah, that's, that's my man, South Park TV. That's when I had came on the live and he was like, um, you beat up the man on the bus station. <laughs> Sing it, don't stop. Y'all hear me now? Big She New Ways, appreciate you, champ. Smoothie King. Right back at you. What another one, Big Sheet, New Ass. Thanks for the five piece. McNugget, Ryan Garcia swings like a wild little girl when he gets angry. Uh, yo, that's why. Now I'm on, yo. If y'all phones don't work right, y'all ain't going to be on the show. Look. I don't know what it is. Oh, Mr. Will, I ain't, I ain't asked for a lot of lip. I made a statement. I ain't, I ain't need no rebuttal. 
So can you hear whoa, me? Whoa, whoa. I know I heard. I heard. Hey, hey, Mr. Will, this is last night. <laughs> as the host of the show, I'll pick who going to be on here as Look. the host, right? I'm the host, right? That's what he always tell me. Uh. You the god going host. I'm the host, right? Okay. I get to pick my cast, correct? Yeah, as far as I missed the wheel. Look, uh, man, who you bring on? About two minutes, y'all. I got to go back to the building. Give me a minute. It ain't, ain't worth shit, yo. He not worth shit. He need two whoa, minutes. Whoa. Last night, he was taking phone calls, working the walkie-talkie. Whoa. I, I can't keep putting up with this, yo. This is a podcast. A box of podcast. Not a hold up. Give me two minutes. Whoa! He on a podcast in the bathroom and all. I can't do this. Bro. Oh my God! Good uh, gracious! Uh, this is this is the second time. I didn't know he had teeth at first. Whoa! Oh. Man, oh these young goodness. kids disrespectful, man. Oh my! Goodness. They don't got no manners today. That these young kids, they get a little hair under their chin. They think they grown, man. Hey, hey, hey Mr. Will. Yeah, man. Give, give me your give me give me your best African American box that you that you seen that you seen. This is Black History Month. Let's kick it off right. Oh, that's okay. You say my best? Wow, that's a wow. I never even thought about that before. I never thought about that before in that regard to just single it down to one one fight. Give, give me your best. All right, y'all, this is going to sound crazy when I say this. Do your research on this guy, though. But um, I'm saying this for one reason. Hey, Mr. Will, don't hit us with one of those names. I'm going to lose it. Double Gum Johnson, Will. Look, look, look. That's, that's what you gotta, look. I know he going to hit us. Look, look. Go ahead, Mr. This Will. Got, this way you got to crack open a book sometimes, y'all. Uh-oh. But look, but look. Check out man Archie Moore. And why I'm saying that Archie, Archie Moore was so dangerous, <laughs> they wouldn't even get that man a title shot till he, he was about a senior citizen. He was 42 years old when he got his first title shot. Hey Squeeze, who that was we was watching Coach Kenny put on today? Um that was Nicolito Lochi. No, no, no. We seen it. No, oh. who that who, who was that black oh. guy we was watching that he put on? Oh he um, uh, I forgot his name. Oh, I got one for you. Might it might have? I don't know who it was, but I'm gonna say it might have been Henry Armstrong. Because no, Mr. Will, Mr. Will, you had one. That. Now you running off a whole list. You only had one. No, 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 come on, now. Come on, come on, now. No, this dude, this Look. dude for in the uh welterweight division, black guy. Um. He used to drive his Honda Civic cross country, and he he was a hundred and four and two. He fought twenty times a month. Black guy, he got robbed of. Uh, he didn't get the notoriety that he deserved. Ah, he fought his notable fights with Mark Brill and um. It was uh, something like. I, I, wait a minute. I get it. I get it. Damn. A hundred. Yo had a hundred and four. He was a hundred and four and two. But you don't remember the name. Kenny, the first, I mean, I he showed he was uh uh back in like 89, 1989. I'm and yo kidding. was tough. I know I saw him. I, I'm just Sir's, dude, Sir's brother. And he drove all over and uh, uh, would put like a hundred thousand miles on his Civic every year. Never got the respect he deserved. It could rumble. You got to give me a name. I don't know who that is. Buck Smith. Buck Smith? Yeah. For real? I'm not yeah. familiar with I'm not familiar. What? I done pulled one over on Mr. Will. You gone. That's it. Buck That's Smith. it. Not the Buck boxing Smith. historian. Not the... Buck hey, Squeeze. Smith. Hey, Squeeze. Buck you Smith. know it's over now, Squeeze. Smith. Hey, Squeeze. Squeeze. Buck you know it's over now, Squeeze. He Buck the main Buck one talking about you got crack open the book and all that. Then he let Buck me come around Smith. the corner and get him. I've never heard of him. Mr. Hey, Squeeze. Ah. He ain't come out of that dark alley on arms, Squeeze. 
Squeeze. So, squeeze. Me. I ain't get him. Did I squeeze? Oh, you got him. <laughs> they got us. I think he's blocked, man. I never heard no Bucksmith. Buck hey, squeeze. Smith. Hey, squeeze. Was we just watching him? Yeah. Pull him up, man. Will. You go crack that's a book. The that's the name. Hey, Mr. The name Will. Hey, Mr. Will. He uh, was nasty. He I ain't familiar was, with him, y'all. I've never There's no heard. way, no way in the world that this guy shouldn't have been a world champion. Exactly. Kenny What's said that? they was they was pimping yo because they used them for the sport. Yeah. And um, he had he was a hundred and four and two. He used to fight 20, 20 times a month. Not for me, Buck Smith. Hey, shout out to Jay Hardcore over there at Hardcore Boxing News, man. Make sure y'all go over there and subscribe to his channel, man. Jay Hardcore Boxing News, man. But see, that's a beautiful thing. Now you said, like you said, you gave me some homework. I got hey, this guy hey, up, man. Hey, you, I, you, hey, you better come back. Well, you better come back firing because. You talking about people who didn't crack the book and all that. Now I give you a name. You right. talk about you don't know you the boss of his story. You the boss of his story. No, I'm saying I'm gonna do my homework. That was one I met. I don't know why I didn't see him. Man, I don't know why I didn't see him because I definitely watched a lot of Breland fights. Oh boy was oh boy was tough. Hey, that's good, man. No, Yo, not, he was. He wasn't no bum. It, it was like what I seen that he probably wasn't marketable for yeah. them. What I'm saying, what about him made him not marketable, though? What do you think it was? I think it was his background. Um, His background probably but they said that he didn't even spar. He he never sparred for his opponents. He say he he fought them in the ring. That was his spawn. He wow. said he wouldn't fight for free. So mm -hmm. his spawn was in the ring. And only ones he, he trained for training camps when he went up against the big names, about five big names. You know what, for real, he was a bad man, whoever he is. Man, you got Mr. Will. You gotta check this brother oh, I'm out. I'm gonna check him out. <laughs> but you already sold me. Man, I was. I don't know how I missed him. Kenny That's pulled that. The Bible pulled that out of his hat. Yeah, he did. I how you doing, Miss Rachel? I never even heard nobody mention this guy. That's the crazy part. Yeah, Miss Rachel, you feel what you you familiar with? What I said his name was? Smoothie King. Right back at you with another one. Timothy stop mine. Thanks for the five piece McNugget. Senior squeeze, Mr. Will Tyson versus Ali. Both primes. Who went? Oh, wait. Uh, look, y'all. Really? I, I go, I'm going to let y'all go first. Then I'm going to come in last on that one. Uh, and their prime. In their prime, I would say uh, hindsight, I would say Ali. And the only why you said in their prime, Ali could stick and move all night with the best of them. He had a hell of a defense. Mm -hmm. But a prime Mike Tyson was explosive. Um, um, I like the peekaboo style, how he moved the trunk. And got around the punches to get in, so that would be a hell of a fight. But a prime alley, but Mike was so explosive. I don't know, man. I don't know, man. We might took him to school, man. I would have to go with. I would have to go with. Uh, Al Lee on that one, and I'm and that's it's hurting me to say that. Al Lee, Al Lee over Tyson. What's going on, Miss Rachel? Sorry to hear that. Maloney Duck, Maloney Duck, no need <laughs> Sorry, sorry to hear that. Uh, 
Smoothie King. Right back at you with another one. Hardcore boxing news. Thanks for swinging by the gym. Make sure y'all go over to his uh, uh, page and support him. Hardcore boxing news. Thanks for the five piece McNugget. Joe Gans was the first African American champ of the world from Baltimore. Yeah, he was. The only four champions we had in Baltimore go Joe Gans, uh, Mr. Petway, and Austin Rockman. Austin Rockman. Yeah. 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 Like me, man. Yeah, man. We we're in a dark tonight. My I life went out. My life went out. Yeah, just get them back. And yeah, my lights went out. But um it was something. Oh yeah, but uh on, on that note, I gotta go Ali too. I I would definitely say Ali too on that too. Let me ask you this question. Sure. Who's co- who was coaching Mike Tyson in that fight? Cuss Camaro. Okay, yeah, we could go there. We can go. We can say Cuss. We can say Cuss. I think that's a different fight with and without Cuss. Without Cuss. Don't. I don't. Uh, you don't? I don't. No, and I'm going to tell you why, man. Why I have to go with Ali. Like you said, Ali had... Uh, like blinding hand speed when he was in his prime, when he was in his 20s before he got those years off, when he got exiled. Foot speed was incredible. And uh, you couldn't hit him on the behind with a, a, a handful of rights. You know what I mean? So the dude, he, he was quick, man. But the, what I'm getting at is the thing that made Ali so legendary but nobody brings it up in conversation it wasn't about hand speed or foot speed iq nothing else ali was legitimately a tough guy they just he was a tough guy he never really got credit for it. they they looking at the back side of his career even the back side of his that's career even the, yeah. that's that's, that's what, what they judging ali off of yeah, it is. They don't know nothing about his amateur. They don't know nothing about yeah. when he first turned professional. All they yeah. remember Ali for when he was in his 30s. Yeah, that's true. Which that's is an unfair, totally unfair assessment on on it on is. That. It is. But I've seen it too many times. Like, for example, a lot of people, all they know Michael Spinks for is getting knocked out against Tyson. Michael Spinks was probably the best light heavyweight I've seen in my lifetime. Uh, um, the same thing. I've seen it. I've just seen it in other cases where, all right, like, uh, Arguello on prior. Arguello was, like, a, a remarkable fighter, great fighter. But a lot just known for the prior loss. If, so I've seen that too many times where, you know, people only have access to a certain portion of somebody's career. And a lot of times it's when they're on the downslide or whatever. So, you know. Smoothie King, right back at you. But uh, not on one Josh referral on. Thanks for the two piece. Mick Nugget. What's up, Rise family? Onks, Will. And Calvin, blessings. What's up, nephew? Thank you, brother. Yeah, man. Uh, I, y'all entitled to your own opinion. Miss Rachel Denair, you in the chat? Come on through. Who you think, Miss Rachel? Young, young, uh, Mike Tyson, Prime, or Ali? Who you like, Miss Rachel, and why? Yeah, I'm telling you, man. It's they just like I say. They 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 judging Ali. Yeah. From the, I see Ali as an amateur, and looked at his. Earlier footage, mm-hmm. total monster. Yeah, he was. He was. You'll never see another one. 
total moss and hand speed. That's who, and guess what? That's who, uh, truth be told, that's who Sugar Ray Leonard got his style from. Exactly. He'll tell you that. Look he'll at Ali and look at Sugar Ray Leonard. Yeah, he'll tell you that out of his own mouth. For sure. Sugar but Ray Leonard, Ali, he did yeah. the same thing. Stick his chin out, wind up his fist. Same thing yeah. Ali did. But see, Ali got his style for Sugar Ray Robinson. Yeah. You know, so that's why I say we always had to revisit the, the, the pioneers, man. Like, I'm going to tell you who fought a lot like early in his career, fought a lot like Sugar Ray Robinson. That was Sugar Shane Mosley. Yeah, he fought Sugar a lot Shane. Like Ray Robinson. Sugar Shane, Shane Mosley, he fought a lot like uh, Ray Robinson early in his career. Early Sugar Shane. But it was only one Sugar Sugar Ray Robinson. He's another one that'll never be duplicated. Sugar Ray Robinson was tough, man. Yeah, yeah sir. And I mean, all the skill in the world and, and explosive. He had nasty knockout power, man. Joe he Lewis. Was a, a, a stylist. Joe Lewis, pure, pure man. Hey, man that, he was real, real basic, but nasty. Excellent jab and, and a right hand that'll kill you. And like I always mention, Aguero, Aguero was a ball down version of Joe Lewis. I told y'all that before. They fought just alike. He, I, I'll go in for it just like Joe Lewis, but just a small man. He was a small guy, but for it just like I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to peek that out. Yeah, check it out. I'm gonna have to peek that out. Smoothie King, right back at you with another one. Hard boxing news, hardcore boxing news. Joe Gant's real name was Joseph Gant. A reporter made a mistake on his name, and Joe just rolled with it. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Like for example, Sugar Ray Robinson name wasn't Ray Robinson. His nope. name was Walker Smith. Dropping them jewels on him. Who the fighter you was gonna say before we got the uh jumping on the uh alley joint? You was going oh, to uh, Archie Moore, man. Archie Moore. Oh, yeah, yeah. A title shot till he was 42, squeeze, because everybody was scared to death of him. They waited for him to get old, and he was still beating dudes down. Yeah, Archie Moore was tough. You got to give him, give him his props. But another guy we got to mention, y'all, because he's the only man to do this since the history of boxing, is uh, Henry Armstrong. Henry Armstrong was a three- time simultaneous champ. He was the featherweight, lightweight, and welterweight champion all at the same time. And back in the days, they used to fight every week. So he would lose weight, gain weight, according to the champ, you know, every week, whoever he had to fight. Damn. Yes, sir. The only man to ever do that in the history of boxing. I'm going to have to check that out. That's why I say this 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 thing here is special, man. When we want to talk about uh, great black fighters, I mean, we can go on and on. Like I said, the history, everything. These young people need to know about these people, man. They need to know about these people. Who was your Who was your best heavyweight? My favorite heavyweight was Ike Bayabuchi, the champion that never was. And what I mean by that. He was getting ready to clean up the heavyweight division. You know, Damn. The butts, right? And he uh, this, this, he came along the late 90s, the early, very, I'm going to say late 90s. And um, he got locked up on a a, a, a rape charge. I, I, you know, I wasn't in the room. I don't know if it was legit. What's up, Kenichi? But the dude was nasty. Yeah, he was like a bigger version of Holyfield. But. He, he fought exactly like Holyfield, but he was a, he was a legitimate athlete. The first fight I ever saw him fight, he fought David Tour. It looked like Holyfield Tyson. It was the precursor to that. They fought 
that that that, that was Tyson Holyfield before Tyson and Holyfield actually fought, right? Mm-hmm. They set a record for the most punches thrown in a heavyweight fight at that point in time. Damn. Yes, sir. Just look it all up. I mean, you know, I stand behind anything I tell y'all. What's up, Mike Biggs, Boston? We ain't read that chat, chat. I was waiting for you. God, Mocha 03, you showing off, babe. Smoothie King, right back at you with another one, Mocha 03. Thanks for the five piece McNugget. Hey, Rise family. It's a George Foreman movie coming out soon. Get wow. those likes up. Yeah, that'll definitely work. Man, look, George was an honorable dude early in his career. Man, you couldn't get two words out of George. And uh, he took them 10 years off, you know, found religion, and came back as Muhammad Ali. He stole Ali's act. I'm talking about as far as his... Uh, overall demeanor he was a jolly happy a jolly a happier george foreman you know joking all the time and smiling that was not george foreman early in his no it wasn't not at all devin butch what's going on dev mr will give me your favorite black fighter from the old days um, you know, man, you know when you when you was young, you, you really had to do that. You said in the old days. <laughs> I, I, I detected the smartness in that. <laughs> <laughs> on stage, Smoothie King, right back at you with another one. Ricky Icky, thanks for the support on the two piece McNugget. Salute, Yo. Devin. Say he's staying at one thirty five till twenty twenty four now. Wow. Listen, man. Listen, man. Listen, man. Wow. Nobody trying to keep hearing all that shit. Listen, uh, until we get a, until we get a Devin Tank fight, I ain't gonna keep on talking about Devin. I don't want to keep. You know right. what I mean, let Devin do it. Let Devin do his thing. Whatever he gonna do, how he gonna do it. Let him and Bill and them do their thing. Uh, Shout out to them. I hope I wish him nothing but the best. You see what I'm saying? Until we get a fight, I ain't gonna keep on going back and forth and all this, man. I, I'm talking. Yeah, I got you. Wait, I get that. No, he playing game. He 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 not he not trying to fight Loma over over hot dogs and tater chips. Mm. He don't he don't want to fight Shakur because he can't make the weight. But mis- miraculously, he can fight Tank anytime Tank say let's fight. No matter whether he got a fight lined up or you know what I mean. All you know what I mean. So I, I I'm just tired of the back and forth, the gimmicks. You know what I mean. Fight Loma. Deal with Loma. Loma's on your plate right now. Fight Loma. Ain't, don't worry about the hot dogs and tater chips. Well, some some of these young fighters, man, are afraid to watch their old go away. That's all. And Loma is still a threat. It's going regardless. It's going regardless whether Loma yeah. get it or tank. No. It's going. I, I agree. Wholeheartedly. But he figured he could cash out with tank. That's what it is. Yeah. Yeah. Listen. All funny video. Bob is not going to let Devin fight Tank, man. Listen, listen. They do not want Tank with them belts. If Bob had it his way, Lomachenko would have them belts right now. Of course. Yeah. You know what I mean? They they don't want Tank them belts. No. No. Only why Devin got them, because cause Lomo wasn't around. He got them default. Yeah, he really did. He, I, 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 that's a good way to put it. He did. He got him by osmosis. He yeah, I mean, really no, did. no, man. It's not even really no knock for him. That's the truth. That's a fact. You know what I mean? Like, Cambosa slid in. He was the Cambosa wasn't supposed to slide in. That was a cherry pick gone wrong. Exactly. Exactly. And, On pain, and, but that was a cherry pick. Yeah, you know what I mean? And, and if, you know what I mean? Like, which McCombin, his dad was more serious, it wouldn't have went down like that. But you know what, though? I ain't going to do that, though. I ain't going to spin it like that. You know, because, you know, they try to say Tank ain't fighting nobody. I'm I'm not even saying that he's not fighting nobody. We all know it. I'm just speaking of Smoothie King. 
right back at you with another one. Ricky Icky, thanks for the two piece McNugget. He'd rather take his loss to tank than anyone else. That's it. I agree. I agree. But, but it is. I mean, but the thing is, right? I'm not, and I'm not, not I, I'm not knocking that one, but that's the facts. Like, Cam Bosa wasn't supposed to get them belt. Right. No, he wasn't. You, you, you know, and I do. That's why he ain't have them long. Nope. Nope. No, I'm not. I'm, he won but it and lost. He won the Super Bowl. He and got a Super Bowl it. ring and lost it. He, he got one. Remember, man, you man, said you guys made it to 42 and they ain't never get a ring. That's not even a that's not a so Super Bowl ring. Did, that's not a Super Bowl ring. He get a ring. He, he will no. forever be in the books as a world champion. Like it or not, how he got it, it don't make no sense. He in the record books for being a world champion. Now, is he a decorated world champion? <laughs> Hell to the no. Is he a um has he defended the belt as a world champion? Hell to the no. But he reached the pinnacle with some guys never do in their career. He won a title. Listen, I ain't going to call him a, 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 a champ. Man. I'm going to call him, like they say today, a belt holder. He won a belt. He was a belt mm. holder. That's about it. Mm. Well, I mean, you're entitled to your opinion. I'm glad you ain't judging me. I won a belt and then. <laughs> I get my ass whipped the next exactly. like you oh, say. You're a belt holder. I mean, uh, 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 yeah, you know, you're, you're a oh, belt holder. So, so let me ask you this question. Even do you, see, do you even, see him getting a belt again? No. Even, who, who out there weak enough for him to be? Even, so you telling me what I'm hearing when you get your hand raised, to, I guess Tony Harrison wasn't a world champion. When he... Well, he didn't beat Charlo, but he got the belt. But belt holder, he a world champion. Belt holder. So Say it with me. belt holder. So when you win, I don't think he hear you, Mister Will. When you, belt when, you, oh. <laughs> when you win, so. Michael Jordan was a bell holder, right? He won no, a world champ. He, 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 he did it six he times. It. That's what I'm saying. He it's did it six times. He still was a world champion. It's the same thing. He did it six times to let you know this shit ain't no joke. It's the same thing. Listen, listen, listen. Listen, when you bring Michael Jordan into the conversation, you got to understand what he did. He stopped niggas from getting When did Carl Malone win? That's that's what I'm trying to tell you. Hold on, let me just stick to the he line. Said, he said niggas, he sent niggas home who sick because they couldn't beat call, him. They, they couldn't Malone beat him. Win? They couldn't beat him. What they call Malone with? They couldn't beat him. That's what I'm trying to tell you when you bring Jordan Nothing. to the conversation. What, what they couldn't beat Jordan. Won. Nothing. Just like Jordan ain't get when one when Larry you, Bird was you, in there. It's the same eclipse, thing. When you eclipse the world title, you a world champion. You a world champion, bottom line. All right. By no, All right. I ain't calm it down, Candy Rain. I'm going to calm up. <laughs> hey, yo, I can't wait yeah. today, man. You know, you know, you know, they working on the computers where it's like you can go through them things. I send this jab straight there, straight right, straight through this thing. Beep! Mm. Catch you so, right on the nose, squeeze. So, so, you know, he win a world title and you don't give him the credit he deserved, I can hear him crying on now. Oh, that's his biggest payday. That's that's your biggest payday. That's your biggest payday. I'm not saying that. You know I mean, listen, by default, by default, Lamar Peterson. What about wasn't he a world champion? Belt holder. Yeah. He was a world champion, right? World, say it with me. World champion. <laughs> Repeat that for me. World champion. So, so, so Cam, Cam Bosis was a, was a, wasn't a bell holder? 
He was a world champion. That's what the belt said. No, you're right. A world champion belt holder. That's the, the, the world. Said, repeat that to I me. I said the world champion first and the belt held on the end. Champion. Okay, no, listen. Because I'm if I can call, if I can call Devin Haney an undisputed challenger, I could call him a world champion bell holder. Fine. Devin Haney, world champion. Yeah, I call undisputed challenger. Yeah. Devin Haney, yeah. undisputed challenger. Yeah, That's Devin right. Haney, undisputed challenger. Wow! Ah, oh, come on, guys. Come on, man. Y'all cannot he? sit what up here he? and he? discredit. What is he? What the, is he? Uh, uh, hey, Mr. Will. Yes, sir. Hey, Mr. Will. Yes, sir. I'm listening. You know, you know, you know. They teach you this shit as a kid, right? With the games you play. You, you remember? You remember this game called King of the Hill? Yeah. You remember the game when you on top of the hill? You're not supposed to be. You supposed to be throwing them back down the hill. You're not supposed to be at the bottom of the hill, still working your way up to the top. Uh, uh, uh. Undisputed challenger. Stop, yo. Stop. Don't undisputed, do that. Undisputed Those challenger. Those are not the views of the Rise podcast. They my views. Uh, undisputed uh, challenger. Uh, they are man. not the views. Prove me wrong. Prove me wrong. I got time. We got. We got time. Look, Prove me wrong. I'm not undisputed challenger. I'm not trying to be politically correct right now because I'm telling you, that's all I see. Like you said, undisputed challenger bell holder. That's all I see with this. Man, look, for real, Cam Bosa's won the lottery that night. Thanks, champ, it for the awesome. love and support. You must know I was ill. And shout out the senior for getting the uh hooking us up with the Sam Club joints. Saturday, I'll go get my card and I'll be able to um load up on some stuff. Thanks, uh Cal Cooler. For the uh, you, love and support, man. Thank you, brother. Cause they've been, they've been, they've been running me down, man. They loving it, man. This, this smoothie uh, program. Face uh, Tyson, face Tyson, face Tyson. You gotta understand this. That man with twenty four rounds, but not even a knockdown. Uh, not even a knockdown in twenty four rounds. It don't make a difference. Come on, man. He's the undisputed world champion. You cannot take that and discredit nobody' achievements, man. You can't do it. You just can't do it. He's still a world champion. He winning to his confines of his ability. Everybody got their own style, how they do things. We know Devin couldn't crack an egg with a running start, with a sludge hammer. We know that. But guess right. what? He undefeated. He undisputed. He came along at the right time. He beat the right person. He went over in his country for them. All of the chips were lined up for him. Now yeah. we got to see him face the big dog. That's what we want. Once he get in there with the big dog and do all of that, then, then we can say something. Yeah, we can say we still Smoothie have King. Smoothie King. Right back at you. Candy coated rain drops. Your body got a candy rain. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. Candy rain, thanks for your support, Queen. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, Candy Man, uh, Candy Rain, thanks for your support, letting us come into your home night at the night. We appreciate you, sister. Say it with me, belt holder. Mm. God, Candy, you showing up, babe, with the red lip. Oh, those are not the views <laughs> of the Rise podcast. He all Kelly and the Bill Cosby. <laughs> no, she grown, not all oh, Kelly. She yeah, I already say, come on, get that yeah, right. Yeah, she built. He built Cosby. Let me get the jello pudding. <laughs> no, you listen, 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 um, listen. It's no Devin did what he was supposed to do. He went over there. He beat Campbell's. That's what he was supposed to do. He beat one person and became undisputed. That's what, that's what he did. 
I'm not knocking that. Cambosis. Cambosis. Won the lottery. Cambosis. Cambosis. That's what I'm raising. Cambosis won the lottery. And and and, and Devin and, and they still had they still had another one. Devin came in and won the lottery right at the Cambosis. Now we got to see what's gonna happen when he fight Loma. Cause he ducking, he ducking Shakur. I'm not even gonna say tank. He ducking Shakur. Now yeah, this year, man. Like this year, man. This year, man. Shout out to the what, 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 what Bill kept telling you say the undisputed champion of the world. Prove it. Point blank, per prove it. You got Shakur right there on the same side of the street, and he's trying to fight. But oh, you can't make the weight for Shakur. Long you worrying about hot does right. and tater chips trying to find your way out of that fight because it's a risky fight. And Loma can snatch them belts back. That that and that that snatches away all your bargaining chips. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Let me say this about what you talk about. Technically, they Loma belts. Belt well, what's the name? Loma just trying to fight for his own belts back right now. <laughs> What happened to all your man? Why your man not saying nothing? I don't think he uh ducking no Shakur. You crazy? Is all man? They already said that shit on man. Come on, man. Come on. I don't man. think he ducking no Shakur, man. Come on, man. <clears throat> when the last knockout Shakur had? Man, I'm, I'm not even worried about it. He's not trying to fight him. Point blank, when the last you know knockout I know. Had? Listen, listen. Yep. One thing you're not gonna do on this rise podcast is defend Bud and Devin. You're not gonna be able to defend both. We gonna do, we gonna have to draw, we gonna have to draw the fucking we gonna have to draw the fucking line in the sand. You're not gonna be able to defend both. I'm, one of them gonna, I'm one of them gonna be a duck. One of them gonna be I'm a duck. You pick which facts. one. Which one gonna be a I'm duck? Just giving the facts. Which one gonna be the duck? Devin or Bud? One of them gonna get it. Like clear I cut. Said, he's not ducking. No, Shakur Stevenson. There's no need. There's no reason why. Was Shakur gonna knock him out or something? <laughs> What are you gonna knock him out? Hey, Mr. Whip. Mm -hmm. Come on, man. Let's just keep it 100. You say Shakur stop her and Chris Trucker, her and beat herself in that fight. To be honest. Oh, man. You just brought, brought, brought something back to me. I see the boy Jared Hurd's giving me a fight. On this, uh, on a card coming up this month, I haven't seen him in a minute. I do. I mean, I do got, I got Shakur over um Devin by majority or split decision, because that would be a hell of a boxing match. Uh -huh. That would be a hell of a. I actually. I would like to see that before the Lomachenko fight. And the winner of that, meet Javante Tank Davis. Smoothie King, right back at you with another one. Doug and D, thanks for the two-piece. Letting us come into your home night at the night, man. Get those likes up, man. Make sure y'all tell somebody to subscribe, man. We stuck again. There's nowhere in the world. Come on, Baltimore. Stand up. Stand up, Baltimore. Thanks for the two piece McNugget. Devin Duck and Shakur. Mm. Mm. He entitled to his own opinion. Yo, Dev don't want no smoke with Dev don't want no smoke, Shakur. Smoothie King, right back at you. Cal Cool it. Thanks for the support, man. I'm a uh Go re up on some stuff this weekend. Seeing you got me this my Sam's Club card. Don't keep my business, yo. Personal Sam Club card. <laughs> um, uh, don't pay him no mind. He <laughs> wasn't raised right. Cal Cool it. Um, yeah, my mother on here, yo. Don't get my mother to lean on you, yo. On another, huh? Don't let me get my mother to lean on you. Talk about what I'm raised right. My mother in the chat. Well. Mom, it ain't her fault. Y'all get grown and sassy and mouthy. They ain't got nothing to do with mom. You can keep all here. You can keep mom, you know, because mom be looking nice when she come to Oh, the there you go. There you go. Watch your lips. Watch your lips, yo. Watch your lips. 
Uh, I say, you seen your mother? All right, was all, right, all right, all right, all right. She was all like, hey, Mr. Oh, Will. He's so sweet. Hey, Mr. Will. My hit list is Squeeze, Tyrone Palmer, and Smoothie King. All three of them at the same time. <laughs> That's right. He keep playing. He keep playing. Uh, hey, I don't hey, play the mom. I don't hey, play the mama game. Hey, Mr. Will. She say, I'm seeing yes, your sir. mother. I like. Still playing, Mr. Will. Hey, Mr. Will. I say, you his sister, his youngest sister. Hey, Squeeze, like, you, you, you enjoying doing the show tonight? Um, On another channel recently, Devin <laughs> said he moving up after this fight. Bill just put up a vid, man. Nobody, man. Cal Cole, they don't know what they want to do. Uh, vid fight hype saying they not dropping no belts. They don't know what they want to do B-side. I, I just said it, champ. I just said it. Hey, <laughs> what's up, bro? <laughs> hey, yo, hey, yo, hey, Mr. Will. Uh huh. Hey, Mr. Will, I'm ready to see if I'm on that bullet in Coach Calvin card. Yeah, I'm ready. It's ready to be all access versus Smoothie King on that joint. <laughs> I'm gonna catch, I'm gonna get him at a catch oh, weight, too. Oh, man, <laughs> I'm gonna get his ass at a catch weight. No trying to rob God save me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Sound like some weight bullies going on. Yeah, you hear him, Mr. Will. Hey. I hey, told Mr. him to catch him at a catch weight. Hey, Mr. Will, you hear him? That's a weight weight bully going on, mm. Mr. Will. I got the height, I got the height and reach advantage. Oh, he, gonna, he gonna make me roll him. Damn. <laughs> oh, man. He gonna run into something, Mr. Will. Smoothie oh, dick. Right back at you. What another one? Dad, what happened? Um, passive income all day. Thanks for the 10 piece McNugget. Devin and Steven would be nothing Money but a born pillow fight. Tank would have stopped both of them. No, that's a boxing match. That's a boxing match. Devin yeah, and Shakur, that's a boxing match. Yeah, it's a boxing match. It's that like y'all don't that's like not a boxing. fight. That's a boxing. That's a boxing match. It's like y'all don't like boxing no more. People, I mean, you know, Tank coming through killing niggas. Everybody gonna knock everybody out, man. Tank coming through oh, killing niggas. They want to see that. They want to see that killer. They don't want to see boxing. And what they, they was doing in the crowd, they was born Tank the first couple of rounds. And, what, and uh, well, what happened? What happened when he stopped cracking his ass? Uh, huh. It's like they don't want to appreciate the art of the sport. They don't understand what they look in there. Mr. Though. Will, they was born tight. I, I heard, I know, I know. <laughs> it was ridiculous. But like I said, if you're not educated, man, with that sport, you're not going to understand what you're saying. You got, you know what I mean? That's all. You got a lot of casual boxing fans. They don't really, you know, they, they only watch pay-per-view fights they don't watch boxing. yeah man that's why i said that's a boxing match and not a fight that's gonna be that's gonna be that's gonna be the sweet signs right there devin versus shakur uh, that's the sweet signs uh, i and got you gonna find out who the best of course i got shakur on that i think me, shakur, shakur got better footwork than devin let me ask you this question because this is the conclusion i came to right hey mr will I want to ask y'all both: How underrated is Javante Tank Davis? Man, if he's still underrated at this point, man, people are just not watch. They not like I said; it's, it's just going over their head. That's what I think is going on. Yeah, because you know people be saying we biased because they saying we biased because of the abilities that we say Tank have or the the, the manner in which we say he will win, but. Man, that kid is a different that that, that 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 kid is a different animal, man. Yeah, he yeah. is. And people and people don't understand because you haven't seen he he hasn't has to use he hasn't had to use all the tools in his tool bag. That's true. You know what I mean? Nobody has made him go in the bag for another for another tool. That's true. So it's like when, when we when we say certain things because we've seen certain things, we've heard certain stories. Or we we you know what I mean we we seen the capabilities. So so when we say certain things, people be like, nah, y'all just did it. Nah. That man different. Yeah. 
Smoothie King. Right back at you with another one, Ram Bay. Thanks for the two-piece McNugget, the support, man. Help get them numbers up. Hit the likes. I need y'all to everybody get 10 people tomorrow. Our numbers should change. Get 10 to 5 people. Tell them it's free. Go on YouTube. Just press the subscribe button. Hit the likes. We talk about all type of topics, not just boxing. It's bigger than boxing. Um, thanks for the two-piece, McNugget. Devin scared of Kerr. Tank and Kerr are best at 135. IMO. In my opinion. I don't think – I think Tank did go in his toolbox. I I beg differ. He um, went in his toolbox in a whole age of Pedraza fight, caught him with a sweeping right hook. That sent him through the ropes. He um uh witnessed toolbox. Huh. He caught Leo Santa Cruz with a vicious left uppercut. Sent him almost out of the ring. He went yeah. into his toolbox with Roly <laughs> Romero stepping to his right and throwing a left properly placed. Right down the alley yeah. and knocked all the hell out of uh um Romero yeah. and, and um uh he put in his toolbox and just hit Hector Garcia where you put your glasses on at around your ear. So mm -hmm. I, I worded that wrong, Squeeze. My bad. I, I didn't. I, what I'm saying is, like, you haven't seen. I know what you were saying. Oh, okay. I, know, well, I was just making sure. I, I, I know what you're. But right. I'm just giving you the different tools. I just named a hammer, a, yeah. a, 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 a screwdriver, a Phillips, a flathead, um, you know, a saw. Uh, the first nigga that I saw hit him for the job. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Tank definitely could have been on that uh, mm. NWA. Mm, mm, mm. Niggas with an attitude. Mm. So what they what they fail to realize, Tank was fighting on the block when he was seven years old, bare fist, bare knuckle in front of his house. And his uncle say, I'm taking you down to the gym. Mm. Yeah, man. Hey, 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 squeeze. Let me ask you this question, right? No, I, I, I got, I got actually one on one first. That's all right. Yeah, man. I'm telling you. Come on out. They got us. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they got us, Mister Will. Mm. Yeah, um, yeah, but you know, he just he's different, man. Yeah, for sure, for sure. I just, I just think, I just think that grit level different when it kind of tank, and yeah. um, and and that's what I already, that's what I already say, sweet. So like, if Devin, if Devin was to lose it all, you, he he going back to uh uh Henderson, Nevada. Mm. Where every, where everything's sweet, the mansions, you know what I mean, all the cars. Tank loses all he back to the street. You know what I mean? He back to the hood. Yeah. He don't want to go back to the hood. You see what I'm saying? He got a different chip on his shoulder. Yeah. He got something different pushing him. You see what I'm saying? That's another yeah. reason why I say he's different. Oh yeah. Tank one of the best defensive fighters out there in Candy Rain. I I mean it's boxing. You gonna get touched. Oh yeah. You gonna get touched, but his his defense ratio is at 80.9 percent on uh, uh sports mm -hmm. sides. His defense. Don't know a pop shots. Y'all see him get hit with. That's just his way of getting in. Feeling out his prey before he 
take it out. Mm. And and he rolls, he parries, he dips under tight guard. Let's look at him. Just do your own work. Yeah, some of them shots, some of them shots that look like he got touched with at first glance. When you go back and look at the tape, yeah, he ain't get touched with them shots. His defense is impeccable, and um, he 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 step uh, one step at a time. Each yeah. round, he get one to two steps closer, and mm. when you get in that yeah. box, yeah, if you don't get out of that box, you Amazing. in trouble. Yeah, that's true. I wouldn't recommend standing there trying to bang with him. No doubt. No, no. I would do with. What 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 um I would do what what old boy did with with Boots Ennis. Move. Hell yeah. They call it running. They call it all you want. You don't get on your bike. I I I would I would do it. But one thing about Tank, Tank now nah, cut that goddamn ring off. That's probably, that was that was gonna be my next thing. And then no. he he touched that body. Yeah, he'll touch that body. <laughs> Plus, he can take a punch, yo. Tank guy. When, when it all boils down, he can take a punch. But he, Mr. Will no, go at? he ain't no dummy, neither. Mr. Will, Mr. Will, where he get fired, yo? He ain't no dummy, neither. You want you know what's going on, Candy. So what's gonna happen in Ryan and Tank? They only was born Tank because of boots fight was a running match. What'd she say? Candy. I yeah. was I was I was reading which one called it. They were candy. Smoothie King, right back at you with another one. Candy Cody Rain Drive. Thanks for the support, sis. No, it just looked like he gets hit, but when you do the slow mo, those punches be missing. I be paying attention, and people think he be getting hit, but he don't. He gets touched sometimes, but he's not taking nothing straight on their hardest punch because they respect tank um power. They know. They can't get hit clean. I tell you another thing they better respect that is uh counter punching. Yeah, hear me? definitely, definitely, definitely. Oh, yeah. Hell yeah, yeah, yeah. Hell of a counter puncher. They better respect that too. Just counter punching uh uh at a uh ninety five point six percent ratio sports sign. Yeah, look, that's what's getting them guys out of there for real. The guys you were just talking about, they were all counter punches. That, that I, I was just watching the clip earlier. He said, and Tank said, he was like, "Man, listen, if I could take two or three of your punches, and I know when I let this one off, it's gonna knock your ass out. I'm gonna take them. That's right. I'm gonna take them because I know when I land this, it's over." Mm -mm -mm. But, you, but talk people, out, fool. people don't be understanding though. Like you gotta watch how he set the shit up, though. Yeah, he's methodical. Cause, 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 cause even with that that uppercut on Santa Cruz. Oh, yeah. he's, he, I'm he, sick of this. I'm sick <laughs> of this bullshit. What's I'm tired. I'm dot blah blah blah. Y'all going on <laughs> and off. I'm I'm getting tired. I'm getting a freaking headache, Mister Will. Give it to us. Where Tank stand, all time greats amongst the all time greats. We want it now, Mister Will. Look, let let his body of work speak for itself. If you understand what I'm saying, he still got some things to do in the game. Let him do them, and then let's have a conversation again later on. If you understand what I'm saying, but as far as I'm concerned, right now, he, he, in, in his division, he uh, he reigns supreme. 
you know. Yeah, he got more things to do. I got you. But the question was, where do you rank him now? Looking at him now amongst the greats of the old, could he have fared in that era? What are you talking about? That's what I'm saying. We got to, like, who you want to... All right, so, 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 you know who Chop, you know who Chop is? Chop, Chop? Chop, yeah. Chop, I, I got an interview. I got an interview. I, I, I rebooted up, right? And they was yeah. talking about, they was talking about, dang, who was he said? Sweet Pea? Yeah. Dang, I can't remember who the fuck he was talking about. And he mentioned Tank name. He said Tank will beat all. I think it was like three of them. He was like Tank will beat all of them. Yeah, this was chop chop. Okay. Yeah, okay. yeah. See, I'm gonna say this, y'all. That's 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 real real hard to say because it's like it's a, we're gonna always have that uh, a dream matchup thing out there, but we would never know some of the answers to some of these questions because we know it could never happen. You know, so we were talking about the Tyson Ali earlier. We have our opinions, but we'll never know because we, you know, the two different eras and all that kind of stuff. So, Smoothie King, right back at you with another one. Thanks for the five piece McNugget. What up, y'all? Was just wondering how close we are to the tank versus Ryan being officially announced. They really hoping this fight happens. Um, a like we always tell y'all, man, got to be patient. You know, we, we on our end, we all in. That you don't you know. On our end, we all in. And the answer to Mr. Will didn't want to answer. I've been watching boxing for decades now. And I got tight being able to make it in any of those errors in the lightweight division because because he's a hell of a counter puncher he has excellent defense and he has one thing that i see a lot of them don't have mm -hmm. is that neutralizer dynamite in both goddamn hands so i don't care what err you bring on it's gtd all day it's GT. He gonna find all he do is win, win, win. No matter what, got money on his mind. He can never give it up. Cause every time Tank step up in the building, everybody chin goes up. Wow. And they stay there. And they stay there. Mm -hmm. The boy is a born fighter. So, uh, you, do you know what you just said? I, I, I said it with a clear mind. No, listen. No, what I'm saying is that's a, a point you made. I love that. What I'm getting at, some fighters are born, some are made. And like you said, he's a born fighter. You know, some people just have it naturally. He's one of those people. Yeah, because he was fighting round the way, bare knuckle. Mm. He started out bare knuckle because mm. he was the new kid on the block, on the avenue. You knew they was going to pick with him. Little red dude, they thought, oh, that's easy. Pray, let's go up here and take shorty, uh, <laughs> little candies and shit from him. Yeah, yeah, and that boy at seven, he understood that mom and dad wasn't there at seven, yeah. coming from foster care, you know what I mean, going to a house where there's like eight people in. He's been fighting all his life. The kid, man, I man, and some of the stories, man, the kid is a. Uh, is he he has that fight mentality, smoothie king, right back at you with another one. Yeah, yeah, leave. Thanks for the two piece McNugget, the big boss of the Rise podcast. Don't forget, everybody asks five to ten people to go on YouTube and subscribe. Mm -hmm. Okay, family, peace and blessings. The next chat. Smoothie King, right back at you. What another one, Solomon Walker. Thanks for the two piece McNugget. Everybody chin goes up and they stay down. Uh -huh. Thanks uh -huh. for the support, man. Make sure y'all 
um, go on to www.kanichiband.com. Use code TRP. Get your merch. Make sure y'all go on to www.narslip.com. Get your art from Damari, one of the future world champions. Don't forget, go on www.com, uh, risepodcast.com. Get your merch, get your hoodies, get your hats, get your uh, COVID-19 mask, get get your uh, um, coffee mugs. Come on, y'all. Let's go. Let's get this movement closing arguments, Mr. Will. It's been a great show. I enjoyed it. Keep your head greasy and the comb easy. Bam! Keeping it simple. Um, Mr. All Ass Sass. Make sure y'all go to the risepodcast.com and get your merch. Make sure y'all go to www.noslip. N O S L I H P. Support Young Demai. Make sure y'all, you know what I mean, go on Instagram, YouTube, and I just set up the Patreon account. Check us out on Patreon. Start pumping some content over there also. Um, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and follow us on Instagram and YouTube. Run them numbers up on them videos, man. We, we need y'all support. We got a lot. We got a lot of stuff we try and bring bring to y'all. We're going to need y'all support to help get it, get it done. Make sure y'all hit that like button on the on the live chats, man. We be need y'all be missing us on the like button. We everything counts, man. We trying to bring y'all the best content we can, and in order to do that, we need y'all support to help keep the channel going. So just keep running them numbers up. Keep running the numbers up. Thank you. Uh, um, I don't know if y'all heard, but it was an echo in the background. I just sound like he said everything I said. I said it again. I know I said it again. Don't keep running your mouth. Did they? I'm relinquishing my hosting duties and I'm going to work behind the scenes. This is my last time on the ass. No, you man. don't even know how to work behind the scenes. <laughs> huh? You and that Android do not know how to work behind the scenes. Oh, damn. Man, I was about to, I was about to, man. He ain't trying to give me nothing. As I always say, peace and air grace from the Rise Podcast. We love y'all. Smoothie King, right back at y'all, whether or not I want.